This is a quick demo to show how you can use Fountain to write screenplays in Vim. Now, if you're familiar with Vim, you're much better at it than I am probably. So I'm gonna do some really basic, just opening a file and showing you what it looks like. Um, if you're really familiar with Vim, there's a whole custom libraries that are built for Fountain that can do colorization and other amazing things. I'm just gonna show you the very basics here. So I'm gonna open up my file. And this is it. This is a pretty classic fountain file. It has full title page information um, with keys and values. It has notes, it has copyrights. It has uh, something that would go on a first page. And it's using a lot of the syntax that is sort of special to fountain. This is a page break. This is bold. If we page through it a bit, um, you see it looks like what you kind of think. It has uh, character names are in uppercase, anything following a character name um, is dialogue. Parentheticals here are in parentheses. So if you're an expert at Vim and you love to work in Vim, you are free to work in Vim and Fountain. And this is sort of the layout you'd use for it. Now, when it's time to bring that into Final Draft or into some other format, there's a couple options for how you can do that. So let me quit out of this. One easy choice to use is actually an online utility that Martin Vilkins came up with and it is called ScreenPlane. Uh, ScreenPlane actually exists, it's on GitHub, you can actually download it, install it into your own system. So you could do this all from the command line. That's really kind of beyond my abilities. So I'm gonna use his web interface here. We're gonna choose the file, Big Fish Fountain. And let's have it do it as a final draft document. We hit convert. Great, and now it shows up in our downloads folder. And here is the file. So this is Big Fish as found. This is Big Fish as a final draft file. Let's open up and see what it looks like. And here we have it. So uh, right now, ScreenPlane doesn't uh, take the title information and break that into a separate title page, but it does do a lot of the other formatting and does it right. It knew how to do the bolds. It knew how to do dialogue. It knew how to do character names. Um, it even knew how to do centering, which is something that's new to the uh, fountain format. So this is a quick look at using Vim with Fountain to uh, create screenplays and bring them into Final Draft. For more information about Fountain, visit Fountain.io. Thanks.